When Oregon hosts Stanford on Saturday, it will be a showdown of two at times controversial mascots. Donald Duck is infamous for his sideline antics and was actually suspended for a game last year after he shellacked the Houston Cougar. The Stanford tree, meanwhile, was once caught drinking and intoxicated at a game. So who's more of a rebel, the drunken tree or the head-hunting duck? Duck is hoodie, man. He took out that mascot last year, you know what I'm saying? He's like the boy, huh? huh? He's on the block. I like the duck, man. The duck got, got it going on, you know what I'm saying? He's kind of guy I carry in the hood with me to back me up anytime. Well, the tree's a pretty big rebel, I mean... To be able to get into a tree costume, that, that takes some balls. Uh, but you just can't mess with the duck. I mean, you saw what the cougar tried to do last year, tried to take him on. Everyone saw what happened to him. And if the two come to blows, which one would come out on top? Um, the duck could get a chainsaw and probably cut down the tree. The duck, the tree can't move. Trees aren't like, they can't move or hit anything. They just sit there and grow. Is that a real question, the duck? Trivia time. What does the cardinal and Stanford cardinal represent? bird, right? It's a bird, I think. Or a kind of tree, I don't know. It's a bird that's on a tree, maybe. It's the color red, right? Um, yeah, I mean, who has, who has their name as a color? Um, we're not the Oregon yellows. Kickoff between the ducks and trees, or cardinal, is set for 12.30 Pacific time on Saturday on FSN. Be sure to keep an eye on sideline mascot action, and keep your browser here for all your Oregon, Stanford highlights, and post game. Reporting from the University of Oregon, I'm Michael Conowitz for Palestra.net, the college network.